All right, guys, so today we're gonna be releasing a technique that I simply love to do it, that I work, used on my, on my final against the great Marcos Buchecha. Okay, so today, baby guillotine, I really want you guys to check it out. And then on Friday, we're gonna be releasing the second move, okay, the cow catcher. Both of them great moves that I use in my ADCC 2013 finals. Check it out. All right guys, so I'm here with Cowboy Giovanni. Okay, um, we're gonna show you guys today on a breakdown of two moves I work on my, I used on my ADCC final against Marcos Boucher Chomeda, okay, in 2013. Um, you know, both of these moves are really important, especially for the no D series because um, you're always gonna be, uh, see yourself on wrestling standpoints, the guy's always gonna be shooting to your legs, or when you're on the ground, the guy's gonna turn to face your leg, so I was on that north-south position with the guy trying to reach out for your legs. You're gonna see yourself on that circumstance, okay? Um, those two moves gonna be the first one is gonna be um, Baby Guillotine, second one, the cow catcher. Both great moves that I love to use it. And I wanna show you guys, okay? So check it out. First of all, okay guys, um, the guy is gonna be in a single leg position. Again, if the guy has one of my legs, the second leg has always to be up. Okay, I'm gonna be controlling the jaw with one of my hands, or if my arm can be in the middle, and I'm gonna block the hip with the second hand. Okay, everything happens after I make sure that the, the guy lets go of my leg. Okay, so I'm gonna grab, boom, sprawl. Okay, I make him let go of my leg. Look what I'm gonna do now. I'll switch the hands, control. As soon as I'm here, see that I'm never on my knees. I'm always on my toes, driving against the guys. Okay, and I'm always driving push my weight on him so he can't stand, okay? As soon as I'm here, I'm gonna give my hand to my second hand, okay? I'm gonna grab, make a grab that the first finger, if you can see here, look, I'm cupping five fingers on his jaw. It's really important that my thumb is right, cutting right beside the ear here, okay? And I'm gonna fight, grab five fingers right on the side, okay? So I'm gonna be right here, driving in. Now, really important that I'm gonna drive the crow of his head, right to the middle of my sternum, okay? So as soon as I'm here, gonna push into the middle. As soon as I'm here, my fingers, I'm gonna grab five here, I'm gonna grab inside of my own fingers, okay? So I'm cupping, and I'm gonna get the second one cupping there. As soon as I'm here, I'm gonna go cup, bring to the middle. See that my jaw is in the middle of his spine, okay? So now I'm here, I'm gonna pinch both of my knees, and I sprawl, pulling into it, okay? So I go one, Bring to the middle, the curl of his head is gonna be right in the middle of my sternum. I'm gonna grab both, lock both elbows, and then the only thing I'm gonna do is just like this, gonna be like a knife. I'm gonna pull into my chest, getting that choke, okay? It's really important that I close both of my elbows as soon as I'm here to prevent the guy from actually rolling, okay? So as soon as I'm here, I'm gonna... Okay, so position number one. I'm gonna do this full sequence. One. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, guys, so look, five fingers, the, the thumb is right on the jaw, and we're gonna cup five fingers on the jaw like this. Okay, so it's really important how I grab and put it. Second the tail, it's how his head, the curl of his head is right on my sternum. So I go here. So either for the first one, I'm gonna grab, sprawl, Look how I pinch my elbows, like close, so like his arm is right in between, so he can't actually twist his head. Pinch, draw up, and then I pull up. Okay, okay so position number one. I'm gonna do this full sequence. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, guys, this, the baby guillotine, Try it out. 